I think Ergo is going to win. He says he's playing pretty shaky today. He uh, dropped a set to FNP and uh, heard it wasn't close at all. So hopefully he can perform and start playing better. But uh, okay. Machu's got him in a corner. This is where uh, the matchup becomes really bad for Falcon. And that's uh, early stock, man. Falcon wants to stay center stage in this matchup and like play the neutral out and get that grab. That grab is going to be everything in this matchup. Because he can get so much. He can get up air, up air, yep. I feel like Ashish Gu actually has like a super strong punish game, and that's why he's like so good at this matchup. Yeah. Or, like he knows how to play it because his punish game is just so strong. Yeah, I'm space to that. Okay, another fair. I like it. Just uh, edge guard situation. It's so hard for Falcon to get back. Wow, dude, that dare. That was actually really crisp. I'll take some. But uh, dude, so far it's been like zero to deaths. Thanks, my man. Really interesting. Haven't really got a chance to see how neutrals played yet because like punish game has just been death, death, death. They uh, keep each other in the corner. Yeah, yeah. Eric is like getting like pinned in the corner, and that's not good for Falcon in this matchup. Like it, it is a 50-50 matchup, but Falcon uh, excels in the punish game and being able to bait Marth's laggy moves. So Eric needs to start baiting out more of Ashish Blue's attacks, but. Uh, Ashishkula really hasn't been really throwing out much moves, man. He's throwing them out when he knows they're going to hit. Mm. Oh, that was risky, but... Yeah. Didn't get punished. Yes, I think you say Ergo is shaky. He comes in where he can't really punish the stuff he should be able to. Yeah. Oh, that was weird. That looked like he, like, forward smashed him right on, like, the hilt of the sword. That was still a pretty strong hit. Yeah, back throw. Falcon off stage. Ergo's got a lot of catching up to do. He's, uh, okay, he, he just, he needs to just get these grabs, he's not really going for them. He's just kind of putting out these mindless neutral airs. I think when he was comboing him there, he took his jump. Yeah. Very shaky game one. I want to see, I want to see Eric play better. I don't know what Ashishgu would have banned. I feel like this would have been a good ban for him. I think he probably banned Dreamland. Oh yeah. Marth's uh, don't like that stage. Especially against Falcon too. You know why Ergo likes this stage? Because I know he kind of tricks the stage a lot in like every matchup. Yeah, it's his favorite stage. It's because like how long the stage is. The long, it's how long the stage is. Yeah, he gets he gets moved to run. Oh, that was, gentleman was so good, but no, he overextended. Unfortunate. The Ergo special. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I, I, you know, I wish he would do that against me when we play, but he never did. He like, always plays perfect. Like, I told him, like, dude, just pretend that everyone you play is me. And, like, you'll play so well. But, uh, you know, I like, he's taking it nice and easy right now. Uh, I'd like to, he's just, he's been nailing the gentlemen's, man. Which is a hard tech to consistently nail down with Falcon. Yeah, I just, I want to see Ergo play more patient. Because that's, uh, what Ostrich Blue is so known for, man, is his patience. He's such a patient player. Yeah, and like, at this point he's kind of forced to approach. Yeah, oh, yeah. missed attack. Okay, almost lets him survive. I don't know, man, I don't like, uh, I feel like Falcon is not in a good spot right now. Like, once this, uh, stage starts to transform, he's gonna be in the corner again. And Falcon has such limited options in the corner. He needs that open field, you know, a lot of space to run, so that's why stages like Pokemon Stadium and Dreamland are so good. But now he, uh, he moves it to the other side of the transformation. This is good. So this is, it became like a good position for him now. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Ah, oh, dude, that was sick, actually. I wonder if that back air on the platform there that uh, Ashishko did shield poke it. Ooh, like. reads the jump and... Oh, that tech, but he helped me the wrong way. Threw in a taunt for good measure. Now, I don't want to see Ashishko get full. Smash heavy. That's uh, bad. Yeah. Uh, you know, uh, Ur oh, that single hit there, man. But yeah, that's gonna be stuck. All tied up to each. And that stock, uh, Ergo started looking like he was more, way more comfortable playing. I feel like he might not be warmed up the way he usually is. Yeah. Looks like he's, he's, he's starting to play a bit better. You know, still a bunch of shaky uh, moments, but he's managed to pull it through. He got lucky that Ashish was the best dude. 
and like when I've talked to him about his play, he just says he has to play really fast to play good, and right now he's not really like throwing out as much moves as he usually does. Yeah. Ooh, that like weird hit of the downer could have comboed to something else. He had him in a good position, doesn't keep him there. Yeah. Did it continue applying the good pressure? Yeah, Eric's gonna take it easy, it looks like. Hopefully. He, he does not need to approach right now. I mean, he may lose stage position, but that's, you know, better to be safe than sorry. And that's one thing Ergo needs to start doing more when he plays it. He needs to start playing more safe and be more cognizant of uh, their opponent's options and what they can do if he overextends too much. In this position, do you think, uh, this 2 would be, uh, I forget what it's called, uh, upset. Uh, but, like, I don't, I don't know, man. Osh, Osh is beating some people, man. He's like, I would actually say that Eric is like a little, it's like on paper a little better than Osh is mm -hmm. But like, you know, it's such a little difference that they can like pretty much be considered even. Like it's like whoever, whoever's going to be playing better that day. But uh, you'd never really see Ergo going to losers. Uh, yeah, and this is round, round one. one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, that would be uh, that would be crazy. But I don't. I think he's gonna take a game here. Oh, okay. oh, nice oh, he got, oh, he got so lucky. That wasn't the spike. That would have been the game. But man, we're like pretty much tied. Uh, this is a scary percent for Brard because uh, I think this is where like up throw to like knee is gonna get marked off stage. I, I think it's like the size it'll kill. Yeah. But in, yeah, in the middle he will probably. Send him off stage and could get an edge guard off of it. Oh, bad position for Ergo. Okay, he could have just landed there instead of. That's it! Wow! That was. Okay, that, that was pretty godlike. That was a good punish by Ostrich Glue, but right there when uh, he did his last up B, when Ergo did his last up B, he could have just landed, he would have been safe, but he took the risk of up being again. Dang. Well, I hope Ergo watches this. I think I gave him a lot of helpful advice. Um, you know, I saw he wasn't playing nearly to the potential that he does.